Some other headlines we're following for you tonight, folks. We're going to begin with new details after a woman was allegedly pushed to her death out of a Lamborghini. New tonight, the judge has denied bond for the driver of that Lamborghini. 28-year-old Catherine Kahn died October 10th at a busy intersection in Buckhead. Alfred Megbulaba turned himself in last month, but now the judge has said Megbulaba will stay in jail until a trial. The judge says because Megbulaba knows some of the witnesses who may be called to testify, he's now considered an intimidation risk. Right now, Georgia has joined 12 other states in a federal lawsuit against COVID-19 vaccine mandates. This is the second set of states to challenge the Biden administration's mandate for health care workers. This new lawsuit says the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services violates federal law and oversteps the powers reserved to states. We could be on the verge of a COVID-19 pill. Pfizer has just asked U.S. regulators to authorize it. It's an experimental treatment that can be taken at home. Pfizer says the pill has been shown to cut the rate of hospitalizations and deaths. Several smaller drug makers are expected to seek authorization on their own versions of a pill treatment soon.